In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly find out the correct image dimensions for blog post feature images. So the first thing you want to do is open the Chrome browser. You have to be in Chrome, not Safari or Firefox. And then you are going to want to navigate to this, the website where you're going to be posting the blog post and the accompanying feature image. So in this case, let's use the spadoctor.com as an example. And we're going to navigate over to the area where we'll be posting the blog post. In this case, it's in the podcasts category. And then depending on the website, you're going to see either a listing of various podcasts and you're going to want to click on one of these. Make sure to click through actually to the post because these images here are actually reduced in size so they don't represent the actual full size that we're going to need. So go ahead and click on one of these images. And then once the page loads, you're going to want to right click on the image and click on inspect. And what this is going to do is it's going to bring up this inspection tool that actually highlights the element that we just right clicked on, which is this image element. And you can see in the background that the image is being highlighted when we mouse over it. And then you're going to hover over the actual image. Okay. And you can see where it says natural 1014 by 487 pixels. And what you can do is you can actually right click to say copy link address. And that will give you the URL of the original image. So you can send this to the designer and say, please make the image in this style. Okay, depending on, of course, the customer's specifications and preferences. And then you're going to simply use the image dimensions that are specified here where it says natural 1014 by 487. The dimensions where it says 855 by 411, that's just scaled down by the theme on this website. But we want the full sized image file. So in this case, it's going to be 1014 by 487. Let's look at another example really quickly and let's head over to vicdorfman.com. Now you can see on this site that the podcast episodes are actually posts. So if you look at the recent posts widget here on the right hand side, you can see that we have an episode here, episode 12, then we have episode 11, then we have a post which is crushing it with recurring revenue, 10 subscription business owners weigh in. So that's not a podcast episode. Then we have another podcast episode and another podcast episode. Now let's take the most recent podcast episode and let's click through to the actual post. Again, it's very important to click through to the actual post to make sure that we're getting the right image size. And once again, we're gonna right click on the image and click inspect and we'll hover over the image and say what is the natural size and it says 600 by 300 so that's the actual size we want and that is how you find out the image dimensions for blog post feature images